Hey everyone, Brenton here. As you can see, gameplay of uh, NHL 15 uh, in Hut. As you can see, I'm down 2-0 playing the good guys. Uh, just been absolutely ramming shots, just can't get anything home. And I'll uh, get a nice sweet one there, a nice easy, easy tap in for uh, for Gallagher, I'm pretty sure. No, it was O'Reilly, I do apologize. So as the title says, uh, HBO 24-7 has been cancelled. Uh, it's been out for a few days, but now it looks like it's coming back in another fashion, which we kind of all thought was going to happen. It's just, I think it needed a fresh slate and somewhere else to go. So I like it. I like it that someone else gets a better look. And as you can see, straight from the face off, tie up this game. Le, uh, Le Cavier just tucks it in. See you later, Mason. Worst goalie in Hot 2, man. This kid needs to needs to lift up. He needs to make a couple of saves. He's been horrendous for me. But um, but yeah, so it's going to be covered on the Epex network, um, E-P-I-X. Um, I'll put you through the link to where the, uh, the rumor is from. It's from ESPN, so... Obviously a pretty good uh, establishment, I guess, <laughs> for uh, for news. Although they are reporting on hockey, which is weird. I, don't, I thought they only did that at the last two seconds of, uh, of Sports Center. Uh, but yeah, so 24-7 HBOs has been cancelled, but the Winter Classic series will be coming back. Um, it looks like it'll be uh, announced on the 23rd um, of September when they la when they lay out the jerseys for the uh, for the Washington uh, Capitals series. On another side note, it looks like LA and San, uh, San Jose are also going to get their little side reality series, they're calling it, um, on the 22nd of Feb, so, well, that's when that game's being played. So, it's gonna, it looks like it's going to be four installments for both um, teams, or uh, both games, I should say. So, you know, three weeks beforehand, and then uh, the one week where the actual game happens. I'm really excited for it. Um, they're looking... The main reason that HBO gave up the series was, A, the cost to the NHL, because by the end they were covering uh, most of the cost, and B, like after that uh, Detroit uh, Maple Leafs one, that was pretty dry by the end of it. A bit like me! No, <laughs> hopefully I'm not as boring. But I um, just didn't have the personalities of the old ones, and uh, kind of ran down the same mill, so I'm glad that someone else is getting a crack at it and another look. Uh, but as you can see, I get on the power play here, and we'll we'll see what we can uh, what we can muster. Um, but yeah, it's good to see someone get a look and, and maybe a fresh perspective on it. I did like the NHL revealed last year, although they did bleep out the swear words, so I wonder like how raw we're going to be looking at. But what do you guys think? Like, do you think it's a good good move? Do you think uh, you know? Do do you enjoy it? Uh, do you like twenty four seven? Do you think they should have a year off? I'm really liking that we're going to see some of the uh, Chicago. Uh, players like Sharp, Kane, there's some big personalities there. Obviously, another look at the Capitals. They had an awesome, they had an awesome one. No Bruce Boudreau this time, but you know they had a good one. Um, good series with the Penguins. I'm obviously a Penguins fan. It's a little bit biased saying that it's the best 24/7 uh, there was, but um, I also like the uh, the Flyers one because obviously we got Briz. Oh, I just couldn't tuck that one. Uh, but obviously those Briz comments were uh, were pretty gold. Oh man, I'm all over this kid. I just can't can't get it away. Get it away. Oh come on, don't bet on the shot. All right, so so that's pretty much it, guys. So I mean for that. Um, but yeah, what do you guys think about that? Otherwise, in some other league news, um, Boston's GM has said that they're going to need to trade a defenseman due to their cap. Um, so uh, obviously they're right up against the cap. I know Savard's going to be on IR. Uh, for another season, uh, not icing there, so I'm pretty pretty stoked with this. Um, but um, just let you know that that's probably going to be happening uh, when a GM says, "Hey, you know, we're not going to probably stick with all of our defensemen in possibly before training camp." It looks like one guy's gone. It might be Boychuk. He's a UFA at the end of the year. He's uh, three point something million. Um, so that would obviously fix their woes while they're still trying to sign Riley Smith and Krug, and they obviously want more money than they were hoping, so... Surprised no one put in an offer sheet on either of those two cats, but obviously they don't think it's worth, um, worth really going for. Um, in other news, uh, looks like the New York Rangers on Thursday will announce their captain. Um, kind of exciting for those who follow the Rangers. Otherwise, Montreal Canadiens are not going to have a captain this year for the first time in... Oh, I can't believe that save Mason just pulled... For, for the second time, sorry. Second time in their history, they're not having a captain this year. So, um, so yeah, I mean, do you guys think it's important that they have a captain? I mean, obviously, they're still going to have a leadership group. Um, so it's not, like, going to be a horrendous thing. It's just they obviously don't have anyone in the locker room that they feel comfortable with, uh, with taking it all the way. Um, I was trying to go on through their roster and trying to think who could be it, but, um, you know, it is a pretty young roster. Maybe Markov. I'm surprised Markov didn't get it, but, um, there we go, tucked it in. Molson can't give him that much room in the slot. It was a turnover and just ripped it by Mason after he stoned me on the glove. I got it, got it two by him. Got it two there. Pittsburgh with Carolina 
fans holding it up. It's it's just weird how this hot thing works sometimes. <laughs> oh lord. So I mean that's that's most of the league news really uh, for today. Um, the only other thing is uh, that I was reading about today on uh, Pro Hockey Talk. Um, is will they public, uh, publicize divers? And there we go, I went it off the face off there, so he wasn't happy, he paused it, so I didn't watch the replay. Only thing is, is that he paused it too early, so I could have made him watch it, but I figured I was nice, he did stay, I've, I've, I've come back 2-0, I've scored 4 goals, I'm sure he's raging, so I thought I'd, I'd, I'd let him go. I'll, I'll let him off easy, uh, still 2 minutes to go on that. So, will they publicize divers? So, for those who don't know, uh, new league rules gonna come in that players that are called for diving, will uh, infract fines, it's I think $1,000 per infraction, but once you get to 5 infractions, and it goes up as well, once you get to 5 infractions, then your coach starts getting fines, so, uh, so I mean, if you hear about uh, players falling out of the, out of the uh, favour of coaches, uh, this is going to add a whole new wrinkle to it, but, well, they publicise it as well, like, you know, players that, uh, that have been diving and, uh, and, and need to stop, in other words, Montreal Canadiens in last year's playoff series, uh, especially against Boston, my god, you boys dive. But um, speaking of diving, <laughs> he just blew. No penalty on the goal, but no penalty. Um, but yeah, anyway, that's the video, guys. Um, what do you guys think about you know the new HBO series or not HBO, the new 24 series uh, coming to Epex? Otherwise, captaincy, things like that, and with the Rangers or the Montreal Canadiens. If you're fans of those teams, um, you know, who do you think should be captain and uh, or shouldn't be, I guess, is, a, is another comment. And uh, diving, what do you guys think about diving? You know, whack it in the comments, get a discussion going. Anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. I uh, just couldn't quite squeak one in there, but uh, make sure I come back and get the win. I'm on a, I'm on a hot streak after I changed my, uh, changed my things around. But anyway, guys.